Hi readers, Frankie V here with another edition of Frank's Picks. Frank's Picks! My first pick is called the React Cheat Sheet for 2020 plus real world examples. Here's a great go-to reference for React and React Native that will serve as a quick reference guide for you to review however and whenever you choose. And it's got a bunch of copyable code snippets for easy use. It's split into three sections, core concepts, React hooks, and advanced hooks. Each section is gonna cover some specific topics and I'd like to list them as fast as I can now. Section one, core concepts, elements and JSX, components and props, lists and keys, events and event handlers. Section two, state and use state, side effects and use effect, performance and use callback, memoization and use memo, refs and use ref. Section three, advanced hooks, context and use context, reduces and use reducer, writing custom hooks and rules of hooks. Whew. This is certainly one link you're probably gonna to wanna to bookmark because you'll use it a lot day to day. My second pick is, how is Git snapshot before update implemented with hooks? This article attempts to answer the question, can we replicate the behavior of the lifecycle method Git snapshot before update using hooks? Spoiler, you can't, at least not yet. But what does Git snapshot before update even do? And what's the use case for it? This post explains all that via a demo chat app complete with code and makes an attempt to replicate the functionality with hooks. This is certainly one of those lifecycle methods that you don't know you need until you need it, but you'll be ready when you do if you check out this post. Be sure to follow me on Twitter at infinite underscore Frank. I've got a React.js course coming out on April 20th, so DM me if you'd like to be an alpha tester. I've got a few spots still open. As always, feel free to submit content using our submission form via the link down below. The next issue comes out on February 4th. Until then, happy coding.